Daddy's boat and then we're going to go swimming at the beach. Yep. And we're going to be staying over at the Daddy's boat for a night. Having pizza and watching a movie on the iPad. And the iPad and we're going to have some fun, swim around. I'm going to be on my pretzel floaty as well. And yeah. The first part of the trip is to head east towards Ardmore. This is only a two hour trip, so it's a good way to break us in gently. And Captain Poppy is asleep in her bunk while we're heading out of Yov. Happy days! So we've got to Ardmore, I'm in 4 metres uh, dropping tide, put 20 metres, 25 metres of chain out. I'm going to sit here for a half hour, make sure that's alright, and then we'll go ashore. We are going to the beach to go swimming. Yeah. Yeah. Where's my doggy? You were doggy the last time. After a brilliant night on anchor at Ardmore, we had loads of pizza and great fun and decided to head west towards Cape Clear but stop off at Court McSherry first. We're just coming up to Cape Island, Chapel Island. Poppy's down below. Hello! We're hoping to get to Court McSherry today. It'll be a long day, so um, we'll carry on. Speak to you later, bye. Yeah, Poppy likes, I believe this, a wrap with tomato sauce and grated cheese on top. It's actually quite nice. And what we'll do when we get there, is I'll get her to make one of those and I'll put it in the oven so it'll be like crispy. That's how I like it. Oh yeah, and she's dressed as a flamingo. And we've just gone past Belly Cotton over there. That's a black lighthouse, mad. And Cork is ahead there. 
but we're going on to Court McSherry. Are we there yet, Poppy? I can see two seagulls. I think we'll give him right away. After spending the night on the pontoon Court McSherry, the next morning after looking at the weather forecast, I decide we better start heading towards home and head for Kinsale. already. We're just after coming out of Port McSherry, which is just behind us there. But we've seen two dolphins. Poppy's naked underneath this, so I'm gonna send her down to get dressed now and get warm and I'll tell her if I see him again. Where are we going to Poppy? Kinsale. Kinsale. Because we're sailing to Kinsale. Swinged. Bicycle. Puppy's eating our prawn cocktail. Okay, go. I'll stop the traffic. Sitting in Kinsale, eating ice cream. <laughs> After a brilliant day in Kinsale and loads of ice cream, we slept well that night at the pontoon and the next morning it was very calm for our journey back towards home and Ballycotton. Say bye bye Kinsale. Just got the head sail out and we're doing 4.5 knots. Engine's on 2000 revs. We're no rush, it's nice out here. So um, we get to Ballycotton's 
see if we can find somewhere to swim, maybe go up to Gary Bow or something, anchor out somewhere. Then get the boat home maybe tonight or first thing in the morning before the bad weather turns in. It's nice out here. O'Brien, summer holiday 2020, over and out. Okay, how to drag a washing on a boat? First, it's a bit different to on land. You clip the line onto you, which is attached to the boat. So if you fall off, you've got some chance. Then you bring your washing up on deck, the one hand on the boat always and when you're up on deck avoiding Poppy's bicycle you put the washing over the boom well airing out the duvets we've been three nights now and there's there's good wind to do the airing out Sails full. And that's how you do your airing out on a boat. And we're heading to that island, Ballycotton, going around the other side of it. Seeking shelter from bad weather tomorrow and the day after. My duvets are still airing out. Solar panel making all the power I need. As you can see by the wind instrument, not a lot of wind, that's why the engine's on. And Poppy's heading off on her float. Back up again now, Pops, please. Up this way. Where did I go? I know, the wind is blowing you that way. Okay, go up that way. Yeah. Have a today. Okay, Poppy in her pretzel float. Watch this, ladies and gentlemen. She's going to dive onto it. Whoa, she's like, whoa, she's like a bloody speedboat. <laughs> Whoa! child! I am a butterfly and it is a pretzel. I am a butterfly and it is a pretzel. Are they two eyes? Yeah. Oh, Alright, you're upside down then, butterfly. <laughs> Pretzel butterfly. Jet ski. Ah, right to daddy. Get out of it. Come on. Bye. See ya. You, you can go home and dad. I'll take the boat home. Does that not scare you? No. I'll be young again. Don't fall asleep on there. <laughs> if you see you. Oh, he's off. Yeah. 
Excuse me. What is wrong? Spin forward again. The weather forecast at this stage was looking very bad, so we decided just to get home as soon as we can back to y'all. It was only a four hour sail from here, so we weren't too panicked. So we woke up to this, it turns out it was Storm Francis. Um, I was talking to a few of my friends on land and they advised us to get off the boat and ju just head home. Uh, we did and I'm glad we did because uh, it was just rougher and rougher all day and in the panic to home I mustn't have tied my Genoa properly because this is what I came back to. If you got any enjoyment from this video, please leave a like and subscribe.